Hey guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video we're looking at a rust based design called the brick. A started main base for solos, duos and trios upwards which takes into account features such as loot spreading, an unlootable tool cupboard and a bunker entrance. Coming into the base here we have a metal door followed by two garage doors to open the area up. You can swap these out for two sheet double doors to create the door block airlock. Once inside, we have the metal shop front here so that you can see outside. Heading further into the base here, we have the bunker entrance. Simply destroy the twig half wall and the metal floor will disappear and you can get inside. Whilst this bunker method is weak to fire, the main purpose of this is the undrainable shotgun traps on the other side, completely stopping raiders from progressing without going through a wall or draining the turrets. We then have some drop boxes here as well. Coming into the centre of the base here we have your first loot room on the right, containing five large boxes and one furnace, as well as an additional triangle here with three furnaces. You can swap these three furnaces out for additional two large boxes and two small boxes if you need the extra space. Through this door here we have the same layout again, 5 large boxes and 1 furnace with an additional 3 furnaces and again these can be swapped out for 2 large boxes and 2 small boxes if you need those instead. Continuing to the other side of the base here we have your third loot room through this door containing another 5 large boxes, 2 furnaces and a barbecue. As with all the loot rooms, swap this out for whatever suits best. And finally, through this door here, we have another four furnaces, your research bench, another large box and your unlootable tool cupboard, completely hidden behind the tier 3 workbench. I do a number of base building guides on my channel, so feel free to check these out. As always, if you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe with notifications turned on to catch all of my content. To seal up the bunker, simply place a twig half wall followed by a floor on top, upgrade the floor to sheet metal and it's sealed. The footprint of the base is simple, starting with a square and a triangle before expanding outwards to add a loot room, and again to add an additional two loot rooms and the bunker entrance before finally adding the honeycomb. To break down the raid cost, this is the cost to raid directly to the TC, and then this is the cost to raid all of the loot. This base is going to cost you 8.1k metal, 6.1k wood and 24.2k stone with an upkeep of 2.4k metal, 10 wood and 4.3k stone. A more detailed costing can be found in the comments.